as we continue talking about an elephant anatomy so what we'll do now is we're going to give you uh the skin structure what's happening with the skin of an elephant you will see that these guys have a lot a lot of hairy okay so these are only sensories okay they work very much like to feel when you touch them okay the hair is the sending a message into the nerves and then all the way to the brain so that's how they know that you're touching them now the elephants have no sweat glands they can't sweat at all okay so that's why i think um, one of my colleagues explained a lot about the ears how they call it themselves uh, is the reason that they have no uh, they have no uh, sweat glands all right so in some parts of the body they can feel a part of any flies like here it's more it's more sensitive much softer than at the top so you find out they feel any part of any flies mosquitoes hair i mean uh, horse flies and etc etc so that's why at some point you will see the elephants throwing the dust underneath themselves and also they're doing that to keep the biting insects away so it's a very common behavior as well as we can see now there's a lot of flies uh, that are bothering him at the at the bottom here so at some point they can just use the trunk to keep those flies away or the tail at the back so yeah